Hey everyone, this is Manly Badass Zero, and welcome to Our Lady of the Drowned Lake, which is an analog style horror game where you play a Brazilian reporter who goes out to investigate local folklore in a lake. And to do this, you must fish. This episode of Zero Reporter was supposed to be a night fishing trip. I'm looking forward to this. The guide mentioned they'd lost some bet, that fishing now would be like gambling with the lake itself. Well, I didn't drive all the way out here for nothing. Just me, the camera, and the fishing rod. Space the suspicious red spots. Don't let the noise rise in your ears. It'll attract danger? Good fishing. Kind of a fairly atmospheric style so far. Okay. I got a bite. Noise zero of a hundred. Real and normal. Observe. Real and forcefully let go. Normal. Come on, fishy. Normal again. Well, the odds are going really, like, more higher. Those went up a little bit. You're not getting away. Observes? So what is this? Almost here. Come on, fish. Real and normal. Got it, but getting a lot of noise. It's a good looking fish. It's some kind of tilapia. Around 13 centimeters in size. A somewhat small, but very nice fish. Fish like this one are the bread and butter of the local communities. Usually we send them back to the river. But I'm keeping this one. There was another red spot to the south of us. Right, right there. My boy was shot. I got a bite. Hmm. Real and forcefully. Yeah, it didn't work out. Almost got it. Normal. Now let's observe. What is that shape? It's no fish. Uh. Did I reel in a. Okay, it's a boot. I thought it was a foot. A ruined boot. Nothing but trash. Because fishing for boots is kind of a rite of passage, after all. Now what am I do about this noise? It's almost at a hundred. I got a bite. Because even letting go, like, increases noise. Observe. I think it's a big one. Real and normally? Come on, fishy. Observe. That increase in noise. It's really murky here. What did I do? You're not getting away. I think it's a fish, right? Yeah, it's good fish. I... I... I'm unfamiliar with this species. Look at the Sphinx making my ears buzz. Well, a fish is a fish. Right, folks. 
What are the consequences for the noise being at a hundred? I have not been informed of this, and I'm a little cautious. So, um, instead of showing the ending cutscene, uh, I'm gonna basically replay the game till I find every unique spot. And then, um, when I have, uh, we'll, we'll play the, uh, I'll show you the ending cutscene here. I feel like I just had really bad luck that time. I got a bite. Let's just go forcefully right off the bat. I almost got it. Normal. It's a clump of tobacco. I know it's a local custom to roll your own smokes around here. I wonder if the fishermen have ever used it for this around here, though. I got a bite. So I'm curious this game is, um... There's a few things I think they have in Brazil related to the water as far as, like, folklore and beings. I'm not sure which one this one's going with, though. We went forcefully. I almost got it. Yeah, it seems like really and forcefully is the better way to go. Oh. It's a Karanka. I'm not sure if I said that right. Apologies if I didn't. This probably was probably attached to the bow of the fishing boat that sunk here. As you folks at home probably know, these guys are used to scare evil away. Apparently it didn't work. How did it break off like this, so? This game has atmosphere, I'll say that. Have I gotten this one before? Yeah, there's a second boat right there. See it? Let me start to back it up. Yeah, right there. I'm assuming that's what that is. I got a bite. You've not been getting bites. We've only caught two fish. I almost got it. Oh, I the noise went off the map. This is a kachaka, isn't it? Almost 3% alcohol and half empty. I wonder if they had this as an offering to appease a so-called kamboklo. Most likely they drank themselves stupid and drowned. Gotta remember to edit that out later. Huh. Well, that? It's pretty big. I got a bite. Forcefully. Come on. Almost got. A statuette. Is this the Virgin Mary? Ah. Oh, this must be the Lady of the Drowned. Probably some local belief. Maybe an undocumented apparition. How did this get here? I wonder if this belonged to the fishermen who drowned. I can see why they would carry something like this. Everyone wants some divine protection, huh? What we got here? I got a bite. Forcefully. Almost got it. Oh, 
A horseshoe. It's probably just thrown in, but... Look, it gives me a bad feeling. Hmm. I wonder what the nature of the horseshoe is. I know that one is the, uh, statue for this one. Got a bite. I almost got it. It's a very thin object. I think it's metal. It's a knife. A little rusty. A little dull. I used to clean up the fish. Well, that's not usually done, is it? Cleaning fish while on the boat, I mean. Oh, no. No, it's done. Well, it's here now. That might be all unique items. Hmm. Looks like there's a big one here, folks. Wait. Something's not right. You've lost the gamble, kid. Pay up. Attack with knife. <laughs> Show statue. Bye. So that's it for Our Lady of the Drowned Lake, um, at least this version anyway. So this was made for a game jam. They said that, obviously through the game jam format, they got cut off mid-development. So they weren't able to necessarily... It, the game was nowhere near as long as they wanted it to be, essentially. So their intentions are, going by the page, is that they do want to expand the game. They want to make this into like a full-fledged thing. And obviously it was a full-fledged thing. Um, your choices would matter a bit when it came to like the offering and um, what you fish and what you don't fish and the whole mechanic around that. I think the one small bite, and that's kind of a pun because we're in the context, um, one that we got is actually very good. There is a strong, proper atmosphere. And the little top-down perspective, it's like, just a little like, the way it's like so dark around it and just like little things being lit up. That's, that's kind of cl claustrophobic thing. There's some real scares you could sneak in from that uh, in the thing. But yeah, as it is currently, it's a very short, very, very short thing. But full-fledged thing. Be mighty cool. And we've got a little bit of unique setting. Uh, that There's multiple folklore related to beings in the water and things like that when it comes to uh, Brazil, as far as I know. So I'm curious where you can take that kind of run with it. Anyway, so if you go watch you play Our Lady of the Drowned Lake, I'll see you guys later, and take it easy.